So I'm in Kalasin with my sister. Yes. And today we are going to make pasta tom yum kung. Tom yum kung pasta. It's a fusion of Italian and Thai. Yep. Because Thai people really like tom yum. Tom yum. And shrimp. And shrimp. And they like Italian food. Yes. So here's how to make it. Ooh. For this recipe, you will need spaghetti, raw shrimp, galangal, lemongrass, kaffir lime leaves, shallot or red onion, mushrooms, fresh lime, fish sauce, cooking cream, coriander or cilantro, fresh chilies, sweet chili paste or sugar, and cherry tomatoes. First, boil some water and cook the pasta until al dente. And while the pasta is bubbling away, you can go into your garden and pick up some fresh herbs. This step is totally optional and only if you're a real badass. Oh! <laughs> okay, this is for today enough. Enough? A little bit. A little bit. Okay. And go to order. Yeah. This is galangal. Galangal. This. Lemongrass. Lemongrass. And this. A few lime leaf, uh -huh. a shallot, uh -huh. red, red onion. onion. Make this good smell. First step is to and gently cow. fry the galangal, coffee lime leaves, shallots, and lemongrass. Oh, smell like tom yum. This will make sure the herbs release a delicious aroma and flavor the oil. Hmm. Are you smell? Mm -hmm. Yes. Later, you put. Yeah. Chili paste in oil. Next step is to add the chili paste. It's also called chili jam. So it's not that spicy, but it's mostly for sweetness. And if you can't find the chili paste, you can substitute it with some sugar. Just about a tablespoon would be enough. You need to cook salt first. Make sauce first. Yes, this is about tom yum pasta sauce. Next, you add the mushrooms. Because this one is hard to done. Stir, and after the mushrooms are coated in the one sauce, mm -hmm. you add whole chilies. I show you. Chilies? Chili, yep. Too much for you too. I don't know why I cook under the sun. <laughs> if you have some cream for cook, some milk is okay. Cooking cream. Cooking cream. Make sure to keep stirring so things don't get burnt. Then add the shrimp. One, two, three, four. I really can't give you four. Normally, three. Yes. <laughs> and tomato. And the tomatoes. You cook until the shim little bit done and you put. Add about a yeah. teaspoon of fish sauce. A little bit. Yep. And lime juice to taste. About half a lime. About lime juice, about this sauce is up to you, okay? Most Thai dishes, and tom yum is a good example of this, are well balanced in sweet, sour, salty, and spicy. Sweetness from sugar, saltiness from the fish sauce, Spiciness you from the spicy, fresh chilies and you sourness from the spicy. fresh lime. Stir in the fresh coriander. Okay. Look nice. Look very nice. And then the pasta. Yep. And then add the al dente cooked pasta. Why do you use black pasta? Because my house only has black pasta mm -hmm. now. <laughs> you like? Um, I think when I take a photo, when they cook black pasta, yes, look colorful. Mm -hmm. About taste, I think it's a bit different. Now we have this. Yes. Plate it up and. Ooh, color, huh? mm -hmm. Red color, green color, perfect. Okay, little bit 
sprinkle with some fresh herbs and finish with some Parmesan wow. cheese. Okay. Good. Let eat under the sun. <laughs> oh, it's so hot here. Okay. Eat. Let's eat. Nice. How can you stretch so much? Oh, it's so hot. 100% nice because mm. when you cook by yourself. It's better. Yeah. Nice tom yum flavor. Mm. Everything same. A little tom yum, eh? But you can also make this with rice. Yeah. Like cow pat. Cow pat. Tom, tom yum. yum. Yeah. Yes. Mm. Everything same, but you put rice. If you don't have some or herb, anything, I think all the Thai supermarket have tom yum. Tom yum package. Package. Yes. You can use that with milk or cream. Cream. Yes. Coconut cream? Coconut cream can, milk can, everything can. Just a little bit, something to make it smooth. Yes. So now you know how to make this fusion Thai recipe go and make it for someone who really needs this. If you like this video, make sure to hit the thumbs up, share this recipe with someone who really needs to make this for you. Be sure to subscribe and help me to get to 100 followers. And for now, let's cook.